Hello everyone, it's Jerry again. Today I'm gonna be doing our gonna be doing our brand new reaction video and today I'm gonna be going to the Savage Snack of a video of his that he that he that he uploaded two days ago. And the video of his I'm gonna react to is called Mandu Game Fuel Citrus Citrus Blackberry and Mandu Game Fuel Citrus Cherry Review. So yeah, I'm gonna react to it. So now for the let's get video right now. And I'm gonna definitely be finding them when I get to it. I know when I do find them. Give me a review in a minute again. So I'll already look at it right now. Yeah. Yeah. Oh, no. Welcome back to the Southern Snack. Your <laughs> life is too short to be serious. Okay. Now I know my Mountain Dew videos, for whatever reason, <laughs> never do that well. I, I don't get it because I'm always <laughs> on top of finding these. I'm always searching for it and I'm always enthusiastic. This is one of my favorite things to do is Mountain Dew reviews. But hey, we're here. We're trying these. We're excited. This is a moment right. in history for me. Uh, November 4th is the official target date, not release date, but it's when we're supposed to start seeing this really churn out. I've discovered in my area, in Virginia, if I go to Gloucester, Virginia, kind of secluded, plenty of things around here, but kind of secluded, things start to happen a little bit right. earlier. So. That's where I'm gonna start going Mountain Dew. Like, if you're listening, please don't stop them from churning out the Dew early because I love <laughs> early finds. So Citrus uh, Cherry returns with Citrus Blackberry. Oh, yeah. So the Game Fuel promo is back. Uh, they are uh, teaming up with World War Warcraft, World of Warcraft. Sorry, I'm not a gamer. I, I should know that it's called World of Warcraft. Oh, yeah. I'm searching for O, uh, but it's in the O. So anyways, let's, let's pose mm. for this thumbnail, right? <laughs> let's look here okay right. so this is it but I you know I don't know who this guy is but he's on the citrus cherry bottle love the caps this time really right. bright yellow really cool kind of throwback kind of vibe there then mm. you got citrus blackberry now right. I'm gonna argue I the color seems darker than last year's flavor Mystic Punch. So I don't think it's gonna be anything like Mystic Punch. Huh. I also think it will remind a lot of people of Pitch Black, but Pitch, Pitch, Pitch Black yeah. has that um, distinct grape flavor. There's no grape in this, right? So it's gonna be different. We know that. Right. So let's, let's start with this, okay? I, I don't, we don't have to review Citrus Cherry. We've tried it multiple times, oh, yeah. but it's part of the tradition. If you don't grab right. citrus cherry, it, you, right. you're just not enjoying the tradition, right? Yeah. So, smells like berry. So again, blackberry, raspberry, dew. Mm. Let's try it. Yeah, it's definitely got a more bitter profile than last year's punch right and we no one could really figure out what that punch was last year i'd say it was like a mixed berry right this is this is more of that you know you get blackberry and raspberry so it's going to be more bitter than a, a traditional mixed berry that would have like strawberry or blueberry in there to kind of add some more sweetness this is not as sweet as that it's still very good it's very defined defined and of course, you know, it's different than Pitch Black. It's clearly different. I had Pitch Black last week. I can tell you, distinctly right. different. It's not got grape, so it's not got that type of... Grape has a little bit of like a sourness, not too much, but a little bit. This is just sweet, slightly bitter, maybe expressively bitter, but you know. I certainly prefer it over the blackberry dew. I love those notes of blackberry. They're like, they're very distinct, right? I definitely prefer it over the B Dubs um, mm. Legend, right? I think it's better than B Dubs, not do Legend. And I don't have to sit here and compare it to that, even though I probably should do a video on that. Um, it's just better because it's it's got flavor, it's got sweetness. For me, the B-Dubs legend is just not very sweet. 
Um, it's very laid back, right? I think the raspberry definitely adds a nice touch of sweetness to it. But not one that compromises that profile. It's definitely a very intriguing dude. Would have caught my favorite. Probably not. I think what my process is, think about pitch black and you take the grape away. I think that's kind of a good way to describe it. And so it does feel like something's missing. And that's, that's what you would be missing in terms of comparing it to pitch black. But a lot of people won't love this. They will, I promise you. Um, for me, I'll give it eight and a half. I think eight and a half works. Uh, very, very solid dude. And then citrus cherry, we don't know what we're getting here. Right. You know, we, we joke on Code Red a lot. Everybody oh, yeah. jokes on Code Red right? a lot. <laughs> this would be a better do than Code Red, right? <laughs> Code Red, yeah. hit the road, we can see you every now and then. <laughs> this one, the cherry is just more natural, oh, yeah. it's just more enjoyable, and then you got like this splash of orange, oh, yeah. right? The, the code red kind of can taste like cough syrup a bit. Huh. Live wire, of course, we love live wire, but oh, yeah. it, it's just one dimensional orange. This mm -hmm. is like fusing those and removing like the cough syrup kind of oh, yeah. vibe from it. <clears throat> yeah. It is basically a cherry orange syrup. Mm -hmm. And it's very refreshing. I think if you mix those two together, this one, you get a really interesting, maybe kind of close to blood orange-esque kind of soda. Maybe you would get close to oh, some solar flare. That would probably be what you get close to if you mix these two. I'm seemingly liking this a lot more huh. than I did last time I've had it. I don't know what's going on. I don't know if it's just fresher for some reason because these bottlers, you know, they made this stuff and then they right. got it right out. Uh, that could be the case. Hmm. But something about it's much more refreshing. Kind of yeah. gives me like creamsicle vibes in a way. Hmm. So, something there like it's a cherry orange creamsicle. Oh, yeah. That's interesting. Um, but it's, it's a fan favorite for a reason. I give it a nine. I give it the edge over. It's still not like quite there with Baja oh. and Pitch Black, oh, yeah. but it's it's up there. So they oh. did a great job on these. Oh, yeah. No surprises there. Uh, next year, I think we're kind of getting a little bit more laid back attempt oh. from Dew to, to sell new flavors. Like they're bringing out oh, yeah. some new ones and some returning ones, oh, but yeah. they're not like slamming people with a whole bunch of different flavors. Oh, yeah. They're kind of keeping it laid back and uh, mm -hmm. you know they're doing good. So there's someone weird just walking around the parking lot. So I'm gonna go ahead and, and end this review, but hopefully you enjoyed this video. Yeah. And I'll see y'all around. <laughs> Wells Fargo uh, I do apologize again, I do apologize for that. In underserved communities. Oh so again, that's the end of the video. And I hope you guys like this review. I hope you guys like it. And I hope you guys do like if you don't then i don't care don't forget to like comment subscribe and turn those we can just on every time i upload and share my videos and reaction videos and other videos to make out your friends and videos if you want your choice because i am making it out so yeah and don't forget to subscribe to the top of the neck if you do subscribe to the channel maybe you subscribe you subscribe subscribe if you have yet you know the main channel here but we're three subscribers and on the backup channel super join two by now and the gaming channel studying gaming Pop in the middle row two, one or square. Since all yeah, and that you know this reach video, and I'll see you all for my banger, banger reach. Also more banger content. So I'll see you next time. Super Jordan, sign out. Peace, Star Legends, and peace out, everyone.